Welcome to Mrs. Purna's class. Hi friends, today we are doing a special project. I like to call it the This Is Me project. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our piece of paper. We've already done our post-it notes and we've already created uh, kind words about each other. We're going to line up our ruler and you're gonna hold it with your pointer finger and your thumb on your free hand. And what I want you to do is I want you to put five lines. They don't have to be perfectly straight. They can be slightly curved, uh, slightly diagonal. And you're gonna put five lines across your paper. One, two, three, four, and five. Now, using your post-it note, we're going to be putting at the top, this is going to be a decoration section. Here, we're going to write our name in all uppercase or capital letters, making sure that the tops of letters and bottoms of letters touch the lines above and below. And then we're gonna take three of those kindness words that people have written about us and put them in these three spaces. And in the final space, we are going to add the word me. So I'm gonna put this in super speed so you can see what I'm talking about. I'm gonna start actually with my first letter, which is an M, and I'm going to draw it from top line to bottom line, capital letter M. And I'm miss, so I'm gonna have an S. It's gonna to touch the top of the line, the bottom of the line. And my name, P. Now the E is gonna be a little tricky because the E lines would land on our top and bottom line. So what I want you to do is kind of diagonal them in. And what we'll do is on the next letter, we'll make sure we close off those so that we end up with a window of negative space inside the letter. P-E-R, N, top and bottom. Now, some of my students were kind enough to write on my post-it note for me. So let me grab that post-it note and I'll show you some of the words they said. So some of my sweethearts were really very nice and they wrote that I was pretty, I'm sweet, I'm funny, the best, kind, cool, has fun. So I'm going to take, I think, the word artist because I know they love, that was what this person was trying to write. I'm gonna put it to here. Artist, I'm gonna put fun or funny, and I'm gonna put kind, because those are my favorite words. So I'm gonna circle artist on my list. I'm going to circle funny, and I'm going to circle kind. So these are the three words that I'm going to add. One, two, three. And remember, uppercase letters and always touching top to bottom. So now that my words are all ready, I have this space up here and I have a little space here and a little space here. And what I can do is I can add decorations so maybe at the top, I'll do sort of a rainbow decoration. And you don't wanna make your decorations too detailed. So just try to use lines that are kind of continuous. Don't add too many small, like little eye details and things like that. Cause eventually we're going to paint in each one of these sections, different colors. So there's my top. I have room down here. You know what? I have some room on these letters too. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a heart here for kind. And then I'm going to put some lines to make little windows for color. I think down here on the bottom, I think I'm going to put a flower. Making sure I try to touch the tops, bottoms, sides if I can to take up some room and to leave some space to make it look like stained glass later. Okay, and let's see. Maybe for fun, I'll do a palette. And 
some circles. sun rays just to to use up space that I can color in all right so there is my drawing it's all set and ready and now the next step is to use a thick black marker to outline over the letters <laughs> 